My name is Lacey and I'm from Canada. This retreat has just been um, a huge wake up call for me as to what's most important in life and important to me. And when I took the time to, to go into this silence, it was just revealed to me that I've been living with, with such a closed heart. So now that I've, now that I'm aware of that, that I've witnessed this, I'm just so excited to go back to be surrounded by friends and family and just to, to live with, with such an open heart and to, to recognize how, how precious every little moment truly is. <laughs> Okay, my name is Adrián, I'm from Mexico, and I really recommend, I would recommend this retreat for an, everyone, uh, beginners and advanced meditators, people looking for meaning in their lives and looking uh, to know more about themselves and what are they here for. Uh, I also uh, praise the teacher for his clarity, his humbleness, uh, and just his way of serving. <laughs> Hello, I'm Gesine from Germany and I love about the meditation that opening my heart and changed my life completely. So I would like to write, read a poem I was writing during the retreat. On day four on this retreat I lost my beautiful necklace in the shape of a heart. I tended to feel sad because my mother gave it to me when I was a little child. But then I realized I have no reason to be sad because I found a heart even more beautiful than the one I lost. This heart I'm not wearing on my chest. It radiates its beauty from within. Hello, um, my name is David. I'm from the United States. Um, and <clears throat> this retreat for me was an amazing experience. Um, I did not have too much meditation experience coming in and really didn't know what to expect. Um, I was a little nervous actually, but um, it ended up so much more powerful um, and inspiring than I thought it ever could be, really. Um, from everything, from the the lectures, the yoga, and especially the meditations and the techniques that we use for opening the heart and for going re really very deep um, into meditations to places and spaces within me that I didn't realize were there. Um, and yes, there were hard moments, but it was um, one of the most inspiring experiences I've ever had. And the teacher, Sahajananda, was just He's amazing, um, so genuine, and so all-encompassing um, and inspiring. And I would recommend this to anybody um, in any, any part of the spiritual path that they're on, whether it's the very beginning or wherever they are in their life. Um, it's, it's an incredible experience and an opportunity that, um, that you should absolutely take. My name is Cindy. I am from Canada. I came to Mexico on a vacation and I ended up in um, this yoga center and it has given me the opportunity to find God, um, something that I never really believed in. It taught me how to meditate. Um, I'm still feeling the echoes of the morning session. So I feel kind of high. <laughs> um, it's a glorious feeling, and I believe this opportunity has given me the peace of mind that I have looked for my whole life. I recommend that anyone participate in this. It is a very eye-opening, heartwarming experience that can change your life. Thank you. 
So, um, my name is Pavo. Um, I'm originally from Poland, but I live in the UK. And uh, I think what I found about the Hudai Yoga Retreat was just a deep um, connection to the to the heart. And and I don't mean it in the just superficial way, but um, connecting to this deep essence of who we are. You know, when I came here, I felt a little bit um, disconnected from everything. Have, having lived in London for the last 10 years, the pace of life is a bit hectic, and we often forget about um, who we really are and why we're actually doing the things we're doing. And this is like a perfect opportunity to just come back into yourself and have a, have a really good look on who's actually there. And from that point, make some uh, changes in your life and, and decide what you want to do um, and how you can serve others.